First of all, when we click on a radio button under this cake or topping or a check box under type, the create button which is hidden needs to be displayed. For that, I drag the on event block under UI controls like this. Now, we click on the radio button called Radio Cake 1. So I clicked on the small arrow near ID and selected Radio Cake 1. Now, since the Create button needs to be displayed, I drag the Show Elements block under UI controls like this. So I click the small arrow where it says ID and selected Button Create. Now, in this way, when the radio button in front of the second cake is clicked, the Create button should be displayed. For that, I drag the On Event block under UI controls like this. Now, we click on the radio button called Radio Cake 2. So, I clicked on the small arrow where it says ID and selected Radio Cake 2. Now with this, since the radio button needs to be displayed, I drag the Show Elements block under UI controls like this. So I click the small arrow where it says ID and selected Button Create. Similarly, when the radio button in the front of the third cake is clicked, the Create button should be displayed. For that, I drag the On Event block under UI controls like this. Now we click the radio button called Radio Cake 3. So I click the small arrow where it says ID and selected the Radio Cake 3. Now with this, since the Create button needs to be displayed, I drag the Show Element block under UI controls like this. So I click the small arrow where it says ID and selected Button Create. Similarly, even if we click the two radio buttons under Toppings, the Create button needs to be displayed. For that, I drag the On Event block under UI controls like this. Now, we will click on the radio button called Radio Chocolate. So I click the small arrow where it says ID and selected Radio Chocolate. Now, with this, since the radio button needs to be displayed, I drag the Show Element block under UI controls like this. So I click the small arrow where it says ID and selected Button Create. Now again, I drag the On Event block under UI controls like this. Now, we will be clicking the radio button called Radio Strawberry. So I click the small arrow where it says ID and selected Radio Strawberry. Now with this, since the Create button needs to be displayed, I drag the Show Element block under UI controls like this. So I click the small arrow where it says ID and selected Button Create. Now in this way, even if we click the two checkboxes under Type, the Create button needs to be displayed. For that, I drag the On Event block under UI controls like this. Now we will be clicking on the checkbox called Checkbox Fruit. So I click the small arrow where it says ID and selected the Checkbox Fruit. Now with this, since the Create button needs to be displayed, I drag the Show Element block under UI controls like this. So I click the small arrow where it says ID and selected Button Create. Now again, I drag the On Event block under UI controls like this. Now we will click on the checkbox called Checkbox Sprinkles. So I click the small arrow where it says ID and selected Checkbox Sprinkles. Now with this, since the Create button needs to be displayed, I drag the Show Element block under UI controls like this. So I click the small arrow where it says ID and selected Button Create. 